Hi, how's it going YouTube buddies? This time I'm going to show you how to watch anime in 4K or how to improve the resolution of your anime. This will really help us watch older anime better by upscaling the resolution in real time. That means that while we're watching the anime, an image upscaling process will increase the resolution of our video. Don't believe me? See for yourself. Te espera, aún no termino de hablar. ¡Muévanse rápido, tenemos que huir! ¿Pero por qué? ¿Cómo que por qué? Acaba de darte el beso de la muerte. ¿Beso de la muerte? Would you like to know how I do it? Stay and I'll show you how to do it. Let's get started. Okay, before we begin, all the links will be in the description. We're on the anime 4K page. Here they'll explain how the program works and we can see three different formats of how the program upscales the image. I should remind you that this is in real time, which means we'll need the help of a graphics card. And well, at the top of the page we'll go to GitHub. Don't be alarmed if you see code or strange things. This is the creator's page. Here we can see and read exactly how it works in case anyone is interested. We'll focus on the section that says releases and go in there. We'll download the file called anime4k.zip. Once it's downloaded, we extract it and we'll have these files. What is this for? All right, let's move on to the second step. We're going to download the video player called MPV. Remember that all the links to these pages are in the description of this video. We download the program depending on whether we have a 32-bit or a 64-bit PC. We choose the first option, which would be the most recent update, and the program will download automatically. To keep everything organized, we'll create a folder named MPV and place it wherever you want the folder to be. In my case, I'll put it in documents and now we extract the program's file into the MPV folder we just created. Okay, this would be the program, but we want it to be installed on our system. So, we go to the installer folder and run the file mpvinstall.bat as administrator. If you get administrator permission prompts, accept them and the program will handle everything automatically. We wait for it to finish. Once it's done, press any key to exit and it will prompt you to set the application as the default if you want. I don't want that, so I close the window. Now we'll need some other files to configure this. We download these two files called input and mpibconf. We move them to the mpb folder, then go to mpb again and leave them there. Now, in the main folder, we create a folder called shaders, just as it's written and we move all the files from the Anime 4K folder into the Shaders folder. We go back again to the page where we downloaded the Anime 4K file and go to the installation instructions. Here we will see two options, one for people who have a top tier graphics card and another for those who are less fortunate. Ha ha ha, like me, copy the option that suits you best. In my case, this is the option that suits me best. And now, in the MPB folder, open the input file, choose notepad and paste it at the end, leaving a space in between. Then, go to file and save. Everything should be ready now. Now I'll show you how it works. We'll look for the anime we want to watch. In my case, Kimetsu no Yaiba, my favorite anime. I'll right-click on it and play it with the MPB program. I want to let you know that this only works for animated videos. It doesn't work for watching live-action movies. And well, for it to work, the options are Control one a Control 6 and Control 0 to deactivate. My favorite, and the one I recommend is Control 4 since it's the sharpest option I've seen.
and if we check the GPU usage, we can see that it's working, which means it's upscaling the anime at the same time as I'm watching it. Cool, right? So, my friends, there you have a little trick for how to watch your anime in 4K. Now enjoy, give this video a like, and don't forget to leave your comment. What did you... seemed?